Hi and welcome to my channel. I'm Tammy, the designer of BadBobbin.com and I'm here to show you what will fit in the mini bags. I've had a lot of questions of people asking how big they are, what you can fit in them, that type of thing. Um, there's three sizes, small, medium, and large, 5x7 hoop, 6x10 hoop, and the 8x12 hoop, which is actually a little bit under that, but we always round it up and everyone calls it the 8x10 hoop. So this is the small bag that everyone's been doing. I have actually a sanitizer holder and a chapstick in this one. Fits in this. This is the one that everyone is using for the doggy bags. The dog bag roll fits in the small and they use the grommet for the back for the bags to come out. So the doggy bags fit perfect in the size small, which is the, um, sorry, which is the 5x7 hoop. So that's the one everyone's been using for that. Uh, you can fit, you know, three or four chapsticks in the little one, or, uh, you know, a little bit bigger chap, uh, lip gloss, not quite, but kind of that fits in there. Then we've got the medium, which is the 6x10 hoop, and it's not quite 6x10. Um, when you add that handle in there, um, this handle, which is at the bottom in the pattern. So in here I also have a sanitizer, a lighter, um, another type of lip gloss, which is a little bit bigger, wider, That'll fit in it. The EOS, you know, one or two of those will fit in here. Another lighter lipstick, lip gloss. So, you know, that'll fit in there. Lighters, lip gloss, sanitizers, that kind of thing will fit. That's in the medium. Then we've got the large. And this is the big one, which will fit quite a bit. And everyone's asking about this to have um, pack of cigarettes. This is holding the personal tissue, another personal tissue, and I've got a pack of Orbit gum in there. So all this fit in here. Yeah, um, yes, I think the little personal um, small two-part two little tampons will fit in there. <laughs> so that might be cute for that, like somebody suggested for the little girls to take to school and, you know, kind of just walk to the bathroom with that and nobody will know. So you've got the two packs of tissue and the gum, that'll fit. Here's a mini uh, M&M's. That'll fit in here. Maybe it'll be a cute little for an Easter thing or, you know, Valentine's, Christmas, whatever. So the M&M little minis will fit in there. You can get an Altoid to fit in there and a couple, maybe some other things in there. Got a Altoid and a mini. That'll work. So knowing that your, your Altoid box will fit actually flat in there, People are asking about how big it is, if it'll fit a pack of cigarettes. I think this will be perfect to fit a pack of your regular cigarettes, not your 100s. I don't smoke anymore, so I don't have a pack around to show you. Haven't smoked in many, many years. But anyways, moving on, um, that would fit. Here's an Orbit pack sits sitting in the bottom, and it's got some room. So this one, um, here's a five, five gum, a lot of room. This measures, for everyone that's asking, about four and a quarter by two and a quarter, and then once it's closed, you know, it's about um, two and a quarter or two high, two wide. So, you know, the bottom's measuring that two inches by four and a quarter inches. It's, it's a pretty big bag. It's not too bad of a size for this one here. So, uh, you know, pack of gum, you can put your sanitizer in there, your lip gloss lighter. It's pretty big. It fits quite a bit. One of the, uh, my testers showed um, that she packed it and it had um, her little nano, uh, little iPod, or music little nano MP3 player and a bunch of stuff also. So I just got all that in here and there's still probably a little bit of room. And that's the large size bag that's got, you know, all kinds of stuff that'll fit lip balm, sanitizer, and a lip gloss. I'm sure we can fit quite a bit in these. So the big one does fit quite a bit. Um, it probably will fit, like I said, a pack of your regular size cigarettes and a lighter will fit in here. That's the tissues on the bottom laying flat. Another pack of tissues laying flat and there's still room. And it closes. So I think this would be, you know, big enough. So, little, little quick thing showing you what goes in what bag. So we've got the small, medium, and large, and you can fit quite a bit in them. So hopefully that helped and gave some people 
uh, a clarity as to what fits in what. So the small bag everyone is using for the little poop bag, uh, doggy bags that everyone's wondering about, and you will have to cut your own hole. I don't have a marking for it. It was something that um, one of my designers came up with last minute. So grommet in the back for the poop bag. You can all probably do that with the large or medium size as well, and have a spare bag inside. So there you go. Those are the three sizes and what fits in them. If you enjoyed my video, give me a thumbs up. Give me, you know, comments in the bottom. If you liked it, didn't like it, what else you'd like to see, subscribe. You'll get more notifications when I pop out with some more great videos for you. Thanks for joining me, and we'll meet you at the cutting table.